So, hey you guys, it's Pyface, and I'm back with another video. Sorry if I just bumped my microphone a little bit, but uh, I am finally back uh, after Christmas. Oops, I'm making a lot of noise. Sorry, so sorry. Um, anyways, I am back after Christmas. Um, I did, I have put out a few videos since then, but none, no commentary type videos or anywhere, any videos where I even talk. Um, and I, I know you love to hear my, my annoying voice, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep doing that. Um, anyways, so today I'm showing off a map that I didn't quite finish when I featured it in a video before. Uh, so I guess there's two, there's now two different versions of this map. There's the one with no cover, and then this one where I've provided cover, and I've, I've, uh, branched out the map a lot. So, um, I'd like to give you a little overview, and then, ugh, and then at the end I'll show you, uh, some secret spots and how to get to them. Um, now, here's, uh, here's a little overview of the map, uh, at first, because it's a survival games map, and, uh, if you don't know survival, sorry, that's a spoiler already, sorry about that. Um, if you don't know about survival games, survival games is, uh, it's the Hunger Games, but in Minecraft. So, um, uh, you start off with up to eight players, and you stand in these circles, these little platforms here, and, uh, I didn't, I didn't really rig this up with anything or anything like that, um, but if you want to, I might make a mer- I'm probably gonna make a version soon where, uh, these are rigged up with pistons and everything, so, uh, look out for that, um, but this is the, this is how it stands for now. So you stand in these little things, and then you all, you count down, and then you all get out at once, and then, um, the, you can either run away from the, the imminent danger, because the aim of the game is to be the last one standing um, by killing everyone else, or to run towards the middle and uh, get the loot from this cornucopia thing, which is full of uh, chests that I won't open now. But there's like random loot in them um, with like some basic weapons and food and armor and such. Um, but yeah, that's that part. And then... Uh, up, up uh, around there's there's chests hidden throughout the map as well like um, in order to, so so eventually you're gonna have to leave the this initial arena so you can go through these I made this sort of like a flower down here um, by the way I build all my maps by hand so this took a while um, you can leave through these uh, petals um, on the out on the outer edges and then you can climb up to to this dome here this glass dome Oops. Um, yeah, why? Is my sound off right now? No, I don't want music. Weather, blocks. I guess. Can you guys hear that? Okay, yeah, that sounds on. Um, so, oh, I know what it is. Nope, not that. I don't get it. Whatever. Moving on. Um, so... Uh, this is just how you navigate the map. This isn't any spoilers or anything. And then there's more chests with over here and some cake. Um, and then you can go up these branches. And um, I'm not going to go up there because it does take a little while to get up um, through here. Uh, but you go up these branches and then you can get to here. Um, yes, this is a spoiler, um, by the way, for the map in case you wanted to find the chests yourselves. Um, there are chests on top of here. And there's, uh, but don't worry, there's no way to get to them from here. There's actually, it actually takes a, a while. It's a complicated process. And there's more chests down here, as there are in all three of these. These are all identical, by the way. So, showing you one is showing you all four. And then there's also these paths that branch out. Um, and I made it like this to, uh, make you vulnerable to bow fire from here. Because this is a very treacherous path to get to this, this, uh, best, this is the best loot. This, this chest right here has the best loot in the in the survival games map um but i'm not going to open it for i'm not going to open it now you'll have to download the map and look in to see for yourself to to see what it is and then you can also go back here on this slightly safer path from bowfire like knocking you off the edge is what i'm saying and then you can access this these chests up here um which each have the same loot in them but it's a pretty good loot um there's no benefits to getting all four is what i'm going to say um but then if you do die you will respawn in here, this spectator box, which is also the beginning box of the map. Um, so yeah, uh, 
I think that's about it. Um, I'm actually going to show you some hidden hidden things and some spoilers after this. So uh, if you don't want those, if you don't want to see those, click off this video right now. Um, and for those of you who are clicking off right now, this has been PyFace, and I'll see you next time. Bye. Still here? Okay. Uh, looks like you're uh, ready for some spoilers. Um, just uh, some secret paths and how to get to them. Like I did just show you that that one right there. But there are more. Like uh, if you can, if you, uh, oh, hang on, let me show you. So once you get up to here, if you go up through this, uh, this bridge here and up around it on top like this, then you can navigate over it and get on top of here and get to this chest right here. Spoilers, it has a golden sword. Um, or, um, I mean, there's gonna be some, some little holes like, like that in this, in this dome here. Like, just th that you wouldn't see normally. So if you, if you fall through those, you can get into here to this chest right here, which has some, some damage potions. And if you really want to see what that, what that great chest up there has in it, this, this, uh, ultimate chest. And yes, it is off kilter. Because I did, I built this one a couple blocks too high, and I'm not gonna move that down. That'd take ages. It'd take an, like at least an hour to do that. I'm not gonna waste my time. It looks cool. Whatever. Um, this is what it's got in it: full iron armor, two bows, two, uh, iron sword, stone sword, a um, bunch of arrows, an ender pearl to teleport around, and some carrots to keep you satiated. So uh, that's what you get if you get if you make it all the way up here without getting shot down and yes there are bows and arrows elsewhere so you would you can get shot down while running on those platforms um, you get that that's what you get as your reward um, anyways guys this has been Pyface and I will see you next time